wheezing, sneezing, coughing, foul odors, or maybe your kids won't use the bath fan to get rid of uh, high humidity and wallpapers peeling, or maybe your bathroom looks like a science experiment. Well, that was then. This is now, and Panasonic Eco Solutions has come up with multiple solutions to improve indoor air quality and to prevent all of the conditions that I've described from happening in your home. And I'm here with Jim Shelton, and he is with Panasonic Eco Solutions. Jim, good to see you again. Good to see you, James. Okay, and speaking of performance, here at the International Builder Show 2015 at the Panasonic Ventilation Booth, you have created a performance wall, and it says high performance test drive. We measure airflow coming you know, one direction or another. You were concerned about exhaust, so we want to make sure that air, we're measuring the airflow coming from here. So we can simply put the hood over an installed fan, and it will measure how much air that fan is drawing, how much airflow that it actually would have. And this is what um, a lot of the home energy graders use out in the field to verify fans if, they, if they're meeting the requirement. And ASHRAE 62.2 2013 uh, has indicated that to, to even qualify as a bath fan, you need to move at least 50 CFMs installed. Okay, to, we're going to take you through the test ride. Right. First we're going to do is I'm going to measure our fans. We're going to start out with our Whisper Green select. I'm going to take the bolometer. I'm going to move it over our fan, and then we're going, to, we're going to look at, on the bolometer, what the air flow is. Now this green select, you know, with the pickup flow, is set at 80. So it's an 80 CFM fan, but we have cranked the static pressure all the way up to 0.375 on, our, on this fan. So to, to really represent a difficult installation. So you can see with this, and I get it up there tight, we're, over, we're still an 80 CFM fan, even at 0.375. So keep in mind that's, and then you would record that on your test drive. That the okay, when you're, up, when you're up against there, Jim, I was at about 83. Okay, right. there's 85, there's 87. So uh, there's 89, wow. 89. 89, okay. I've got my 89, Jim. I've got it, okay. So I'm, I'm telling you, I love over. this, I love move this. Over to the next contestant. Okay. And this is, once again, this is a 80 CFM fan. It is a competitor's fan. Yeah. All yeah, right. I guess so. so. All right, let's give it the so test. Let's, let's get the look, bolometer on here. Go ahead. Flow. We're going to put the bolometer up there. This, as I said, like I said, this is an 80 CFM fan. One, it's also installed at the same static pressure, you know, 0.375. And you can look, not bad, not bad. 75, 76, 77. So it's an 80. So it's, it's doing pretty good, right? That, pretty well. That's package A, yes? Package A. But now let's move down All right. to this, this manufacturer's uh, entry-level Energy Star fan, keeping in mind that you need you know 50 CFMs uh, installed to meet ASHRAE 62.2. Uh, James, what would be your guess that we come in on this one? You know, the EcoVent, you got 51 and passed. What do you think about this one? What's your guess? I'm going to guess that this will give us 47. So I've got the bolometer on there. We got it nice and tight. I'm a nervous wreck, Jim. Let's see how you did. <laughs> the bolometer. I mean, that was a fair guess. Right. Forty. That, my, so, that would be my minimum expectations as a builder or as a so, consumer. So where are we at? I'm not happy, Jim. We're at 39. You got We're up, at four. We got up to 40. We got up to 40. So we'll lock that in. Wow. So we have 40 CFMs. Now, what did I say you needed to hit to to qualify as a bath fan? 50 CFM minimum. So this fan would would not qualify and would be reg tag. On the game show network, we'd give it a ah. <laughs> Now we're going to move over to package B, right? Once again, we're going to go up to the premium. This is a premium uh, fan. It's Energy Star rated, uh, 80 CFM. So what's your guess, James? Uh, Energy Star rated, 80 CFM, premium package, same static pressure. I'm going to say that this fan ought to be at about 78. 78. Okay, your guess is a 78, so I'm going to put the bolometer up there. I'm going to get it nice and tight up in there, and we can look at this one. Um, you were at 78? Do I, have, do I have to get my glasses on? You I said, wait so. a minute, you said 80 CFM. 80 CFM Energy Star fan. 
installed in you know installed at the same static pressure as the other two fans you've already looked at. So what, I'm what? I'm really astounded. I'm so really Jim. I'm astounded. I, I as a consumer advocate, I have a hard time believing that there's a product that purports to be 80 cfm efficient, and this bolometer is at 19. Well, the bolometer doesn't lie, James. So, but I think the key with this wall is that you know if, if before you had taken this test drive, James, and I told you all these fans were 80, they are all Energy Star, they are all 70 cfm you would not have guessed this type of performance. Jim, you know, as a builder, we do our best to deliver uh, an installed product. That's whether it's two by fours or flooring or, or paint, uh, the best in terms of lasting quality, appearance, and efficiency. I am completely blown away by these numbers. I'm completely blown away that there are products that are purporting to be 80 CFM that come in at 19 CFM and that consumers really, really right. need to be aware of this. And builders, more importantly, need to know about what they're delivering to their clients in as much as efficiency is concerned. Where can our viewers get more information on what we've discussed here in detail, Jim? Well, really what we've been talking about is the Panasonic Performance Package, like I like to say, and we've even you know, have it you know, here on our, our, our uh, shirts with EcoVent. But you can go to panasonic.com forward slash ventfan. Really an eye-opening experience. Jim Shelton, Jim Shelton with Panasonic Ecosystems, do visit our website at onthehouse.com where you can get more information on the discussion of efficiency and how you as a builder or a remodeler or a consumer can benefit from this information and the technology. James Carey reporting from Panasonic, the International Builder Show 2015, Las Vegas.